Hey guys! Hi guys! Making this video um, partially for Crafts for Reborns because she wanted to see all my vampires. I have 11 at the moment. She has a lot. I have a lot. But they're so, so different. Sorry that my phone, or Em's phone, keeps refocusing. My phone is so full of baby pictures, I can't even take one video, you guys. Uh -huh. Isn't she that sad? I don't want to delete. So, I'll introduce them for everybody who doesn't maybe remember. This is Bella. She is created by Bean. She's a little newborn vamp. This is Alexa. She was created by me and Ems. And obviously she's like toddler size kind of. I don't know. What, what is she supposed to be? Three to six? I don't, know. I don't yeah. know. This is Willow. And she was created by me and Ems. I don't know why that won't focus. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> These are the Lolas. Both created by Bean. It's funny because this Lola on the right is the one that inspired the Lola on the left. And then I got the Lola on the right on eBay. <laughs> this is Harper. She was created by me and Ems. And she does have a wig that is not uh, rooted hair, but it looks really good it on her. It works perfect for her. This, you guys know, is Lennox. And she's created by me and Ems. These are the twins, the other twins. This is Laitha Jade, created by Bean. And Layla Jane, also created by Bean. Stella, who you all, I'm sure, know, is created by Bean. And this one is a Randy Renee baby, and she didn't start out as a vampire, but there goes my phone. Yeah. Um, I just thought she looked so cute that way. Yes. So, there they are. Um, and I wanted to address a comment um, that someone had made about having the same characters, too many vampires or too many zombies, like you're only supposed to have one. Yeah. I think that's ridiculous. Um, for a couple of reasons. One, it's not anyone's right to tell me what to do with my collection. That's a collection. You yeah. Collect. Two, um, that's like saying you can only listen to one artist, like one song from one artist, or one, you know, you can only watch one vampire horror movie and one zombie horror <laughs> movie. Like, and the... All the idea that they're similar to me is just ridiculous because Stella, as you can see, looks nothing like Layla. The Lolas look nothing like Jade. I mean, yeah, they they're all, all very different. They are all uniquely different. And I choose them. You know, when I see a sculpt, it's not about how many vampires I have or how many zombies or how many humans. It's how, would, how do I think that would look the best? Yeah. What character fits that the best? And so that's how I ended up with so many vampires. <laughs> Because I just of kids thought, that make good vampires. yeah, there's a lot of kids that make good vampires. So, you know, like this one, for instance, had to be a vampire. If there was an open eyed one, I'd make a zombie out of it. But, <laughs> you know, some kids just lend themselves to certain things. So, did I intend to have 11 vampires? No. Am I happy with my 11 vampires? Yes. Hell yes, I am. <laughs> I love my collection. And I have a lot of babies. I have about 30 at this point. And, uh,. And you plan on getting more if you see kits. And I may like. get more if I get kits that I like. I don't do the whole, you know, I have to get a limited edition or I have to get the newest thing that comes out. If I like something, I'll get it. But that's that's it. I don't, like, search out what is the rarest or don't have to have prototypes of everything. You know, I, I choose what I think is cute. Yeah. And I'm very happy with my collection. I also don't treat them like real babies. I think if I did do that, 30 would probably be too many, you know? Yeah, because you, yeah. But I don't do well. that. I mean, you guys know I make videos of different babies all the time, and I'm trying to fit more of them in, you know, as we go along. But, I mean, I don't, I don't interact with all of them every single day, so yeah. I don't need to and only of, have a few. Some of them you interact with just as you want, and that will be your baby for the week or whatever that you yeah. interact with. And, and I don't video every yeah. interaction or but, every time I take them out even. But she does. I have to tell you guys, the babies will sit in the crib with the same outfit on and then she'll like she'll be like, they already saw that outfit. We got to change it. <laughs> <laughs> I am guilty of that. But, you know, that's why they stay in good condition because I don't, I'm not constantly, you know, changing them, which if that's your thing, that's fine. I mean, do what you want with your stuff. Um, but I've... I don't, I, I don't have time or the energy to change all of them every day. No. But the idea that I shouldn't have more than one vampire because they're too similar. I mean, obviously that face, <laughs> that face is quite different I mean, from these faces. Which and yeah, I mean, that's like saying you can only have one kid. Yeah. One boy, one girl, that's it, you're done. I mean, it's just kind of goofy to me. 
So yeah, I have a lot of dolls, and I love them, and I don't plan on, I don't, like, I have X amount of this, so I have to stop. Yeah. You know, that it just doesn't work that way. So anyway, those are my vamps, and uh, that's all I really want to say. Bye. Bye.